So I'm Omar Hassan. I'm one of the interventional radiologists here at Roswell Park. Embolization for cancer patient is basically we're blocking off blood supply to the tumor to prevent it from, from growing and propagating, essentially trying to kill the tumor. And really the big organ we do that is liver, because the liver is a unique organ in that it's the only organ in the body where the portal vein provides 60 to 70 percent of the blood supply to the normal liver, whereas tumors uh, require arterial blood flow, so 100 percent of the tumor's blood supply comes from the artery. And so what we do is we take advantage of that by placing catheters into the arteries going to the liver and finding the arteries feeding the tumor and injecting particles that either just plain particles, particles that have chemotherapy on them or particles that have radiation on them uh, to treat tumors in the liver, whether they're primary liver tumors or metastatic tumors that are to the liver. So typically for the most part, embolization is performed in patients that can't get surgery for multiple reasons, whether they have multiple tumors that can't all be resected or potentially uh, where they have a tumor that they're trying to shrink to get to surgery or if there's just no surgical option. This can be done in combination with medical treatments or depending on the tumor type, just as standalone therapy. And these are you know, minimally invasive procedures. We don't use general anesthesia for these procedures. Patients typically either go home the same day or the day after the procedure and have very um, short recoveries as opposed to major surgery.